the breaking inputs as well. Remember the uh, float strategy meeting that we told you about? Well, we're given to understand that is going to begin any time now. The floor leaders of the IND block are going to meet at around 10.15 and they will strategize on their next move. What we're also given to understand is that uh, uh, strategy is uh, going to be planned and chalked out as far as cornering the government, mounting pressure on the government on suspension is concerned. And part of that is the march that the suspended MPs are going to carry out from the uh, old parliament building to Vijay Chowk. That's the breaking input coming in. So first a uh, meeting of the INDI floor leaders to strategize. And after that at around 11 a.m. Uh, the MPs are going to gather at Vijay Chowk from where we are reporting live. And the security deployment here is massive. Clearly anticipating that the MP suspended MPs are uh, going to come here from the old parliament building march to Vijay Chowk. This of course is a message that the opposition is trying to send out to the government uh, through these protest marches. We have Sabesachi joining us with more details. Sabesachi, uh, security deployment in place. There's a meeting of the floor leaders of INDI that is going to take place, after which we will see march from Old Panmil Binding to Vijay Chowk. Uh, well, uh, absolutely. Let me show you uh, uh, our viewers uh, the security deployment here at Vijay Shock. Uh, on your screen, you can see massive deployment of the Delhi Police and CRPF personnel at uh, Vijay Chowk. Now, uh, the floor leaders would be me meeting at uh, Malikarjun Khadge's office. After that, they would be marching from the old parliament building uh, towards Vijay Chowk to hold a protest. Now, today and tomorrow would be extremely crucial from the opposition point of view because they had called in a massive protest here in the national capital tomorrow as well at Jantan Mantar, where from Jantan Mantar also they would be marching towards the parliament. Now the opposition leaders had met yesterday at Malikarjun Khadge's residence to decide on the future course of action, to decide how are they going to take uh, forward the suspension of uh, 143 MPs that had uh, taken place. Now the opposition parties are putting allegation on the central government that the central government is trying to run away from the question posed at them by the opposition parties and that is the reason why so much of suspension is taking place. Now we had seen that at the India Bloc Party meeting as well, two resolutions were passed. One of the resol resolution was on the suspension of MPs. Now the India Bloc uh, Party say that in the coming days they would hold separate uh, uh, protests across the country and also hold uh, a joint rally uh, in Patna where they are going to speak on this issue as well. Now the opposition leaders are saying that we have been asking normal question to the government. We want Home Minister to address uh, about uh, the issue of uh, Parliament breach and also uh, uh, a discussion should take place in both their houses. These are the two basic demands which the opposition parties are asking. Now they are also claiming that when Prime Minister and HM spoke about the issue, if they can speak about the issue outside the Parliament, then why can't they speak about the issue Absolutely. inside the Parliament? The logjam now, continues inside the Parliament. Uh, the suspensions continue as well and outside the parliament the protest of the suspended MPs will take place. The march from uh, old parliament building to Vijay Chowk. Uh, the opposition says that this is Tana Shahi mindset of the Modi government and that they want an opposition free parliament. That is why all the MPs one by one of the opposition are being suspended by the government in uh, uh, you know uh, name of creating ruckus and chaos inside the house. We have